This is a look at set three of the real riders that you can get directly from Mattel. This I, Earlier I did a video of the first set. I have ordered all three sets, but the second set hasn't arrived yet. This third set arrived today, August 6th, 2022. This is an off-road tire set, as you see there. And they're really nice looking tires and wheels. <laughs> And they really are handy when you just want to drop them into a casting. Um, they're the wheels that basically you're going to take off castings. If, if you do real rider swaps and you've been buying castings to take the wheels off, this eliminates the need to remove them from the casting. They've done that for you by not sticking them into one. Um, I, I really like the looks of some of these. Um, uh, some of these, eh, I, I can see them working out in certain applications, but some I think will just look good on anything in a way. You'll see at the top, it says contents times two. Don't be deceived by that. They're basically showing you in the picture, the front, let's just say the front and rear tires. And that times two just means that you get a set for the other side of the car. For each of these six designs, you only get one set for a vehicle, four tires for a vehicle. So don't be thrown off. Basically, by buying this, you've received six sets of wheels for, a car, for cars. You can do six cars. Have I explained that enough? <laughs> Have I made it wordy enough? Like I did in the earlier review of set one, I'm going to get out my digital calipers here and give you a rough idea of the sizes of these because these are truly real riders and they're squishy. <laughs> so they are my measurements there are not going to be dead on. It depends on how much I smushed them and I tried not to smush them at all. But there you can see the readings in millimeters for each of these sets. Um, again, these are all off-road tires, so some of you aren't going to want this set. I'm looking at them as probably being great for some Gaslands builds. Um, I, you know, I don't do a lot of off-road vehicles other than Gaslands builds, and so I wasn't really sure. I wasn't sure how excited I was to be getting these, and uh, thought about just skipping this set. And then I gave in. Actually, there was a vehicle that I purchased through the club website at the same time. And it kind of helped defray some of the shipping uh, because they just charged the shipping charge for the full order. So there you see the sizes of these. I had this casting that I had taken apart before to steal the wheels off of. <laughs> the 17 uh, Ford Raptor. And so I thought, well, what the heck? I'll use that casting and I'll throw each one of these sets on it so you get an idea of how they look. The large sets, the two oversized sets that you'll see here, uh, the first two sets, the previous one and this one, fit a little tight. And they may take a little work if you really want it to roll. The others it will roll fine with on this casting. But my goal here was to give you an idea of how they looked. Some of these are just fantastic. I love the looks of that set. I think if I could have got a set, like a box of just those, I would have been thrilled. The Aero Hub is kind of interesting. It, I don't think it worked for a Gaswans build, but maybe, I don't know, maybe if you went a sci-fi kind of, I, I don't know. But there you see the multiple sets. And uh, they look good. You do have to be a, a Red Line Club member to get them, which is $9.99 a year. And uh, you can buy, I believe it was up to five sets. As of today, they are still available on the website, as are sets one and two. So uh, I hope this gives you an idea of what they're like. And uh, thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.